Good morning, everyone, and a very happy Palm Sunday to you all. Boys and girls, Palm Sunday always happens the Sunday before Easter Sunday. And it's a very important day because it marks the start of Holy Week, which is Jesus's journey to the cross. In each of the Gospels, we find the story of Jesus's triumphant entry into Jerusalem. The people cut palm branches and waved them in the air. Then they laid them out across the road before him as he rode his donkey into the city. The palm branch is actually known to represent goodness and victory. Perhaps a bit symbolic of the victory Jesus would soon fulfill over sin. But no one knew this at the time, only Jesus. They had no idea what lied ahead in the week to come. They just knew at that moment they wanted to worship and praise Jesus, their King and Savior. Listen to the Gospel of Matthew. A massive crowd spread their cloaks on the road while others cut branches from the trees and spread them on the road. The crowds that went ahead of him and those that followed were shouting, Hosanna to the son of David. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. When Jesus had entered Jerusalem, the whole city was stirred and asked, who is this? The whole city was stirred. I can almost imagine how that must feel. Voices cheering and shouting, people trying to see over the crowds just who it was coming that day. As they called out, Hosanna, they were calling Christ the King. The word Hosanna means to save now. And though in their own minds, they eagerly, eagerly awaited an earthly king, God had a different plan entirely. He was providing a different way to set us free forever. This is the greatness of why we celebrate this week. Because of Jesus' ultimate sacrifice and his love for us and God's love for us, we are set free. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for sending your son and paving the way for our lives to be set free through him. Thank you for this day and for the week ahead and for reminding us that Jesus truly is our King of Kings. In his name we pray, amen.